Hi, it's me, T. Welcome back to the ranch at five something in the morning. <laughs> we are headed out to move a group of pears. We have the two older kids with us because there is a late start today for school. So they are gonna go, they're gonna go ranching before school. We told them they didn't have to come out, but they wanted to. So I think that's really cool. Morning. Morning. Morning, 10. <laughs> You're an owl. Look at him, Tinley. He's sniffing on you. Sniffing the air. Do you want to be my friend? <laughs> Go with your mom, kid. Bumping trip. Where? Nursing this black cow? Yeah. You're really getting aggressive with her. <laughs> I'm just taking it nice and easy to let the cows find their calves and pair up. We, we know you had your mom. You got a big old milk mustache. <laughs> Certified yellow belt since 1997. It's Uncle Doug's birthday today. Thirty-four, maybe? Eighty-seven? Uncle Tyler's going to be thirty the day you guys get out of school. Bump him, Trip. His mom's right there. Good job, buddy.
Don't don't get ahead of his cows, Tin. We'll stop right here till Trip gets those moving. Ahead? Yeah. Just sh push stuff your way and then go to the gate. What? Send stuff that's up here this way and then go to the gate. Come on, Trippy. Trip and I came to open the gates because we're taking these pairs across the road and uh, I he's he's gonna direct traffic up there at the road and I am gonna come over here to the tank where these pairs are holding up and get them moving that way and by direct traffic what he's doing I mean the, the cows not a lot of traffic on our road Mr. FFB and Tan are in the back, slowly bringing stuff. I'll take that one pair. Go on, 68. You're a good mom. Take your baby. Good girl. Thought maybe if the other one saw her go, they would come too, but that, that isn't really what happened. <laughs> I know, he's kind of rude. Back up a little trip, you're stopping them. You can't, can't get in front of them because that stops them. Two gates and a road to cross makes moving pairs a little messy. <laughs> You're doing good, sis. Go on, little babies. Go on, little babies. <laughs> they struggle, yes. Well, they pair up, and then they, when you ask them to move, they just go their own way. Trip over here is freezing. I told him it was cold out this morning and he chose to only wear a sweatshirt. Now that we made it through the first gate, there's the second gate, but we're just holding them here, hoping that they'll kind of pair up and get it figured out. But like I said, they're young pairs, Two gates in a road, it gets messy. Sorry, that was really close. <laughs> Trip, are you paying attention? <laughs> oh, see, they're coming back to look for babies. We have a new plan. <laughs> because these two gates that the cows had to go through across 
and go across the road are offset a little bit it makes it even more challenging and so um, the way this pasture that we're actually in right now the pasture that the road is in the way it's set up it kind of funnels down towards our house which is just right there um, so Mr. FFB is gonna walk up the road or he is walking up the road and he's gonna just cut the fence <laughs> up the funnel a little ways and because that's the way the cows kind of want to go and the calves kind of want to go so rather than try and fight it and cause more of a mess and put them in this gate we're just going to cut the fence and put them in and probably put a gate there our plan b worked and now the kids and I are headed back to untack horses and put them away. And we're, <laughs> we're walking because I, look, the house is right over there. You found it. Oh, <laughs> you found, mom, I found a deer. What is that? I know what it, I know it's a reindeer, but like, oh. Wonder where that came from.